All Z's, man. Everything you need to know, nigga. When you need to know it, man. Just chop it up a little bit about uh, motherfucking Adrian Brown and Mikey Garcia last night, man. It went down for sure. You feel me? Went down for sure. Opening round, AB, you know, he showed good movement. You know, uh, moved a lot, actually, more than everybody thought, man. Moved more than everybody thought and shit. But Mikey just was filling him out, man. First round probably went to AB. Mikey ain't do too much. AB was pumping the jab. A lot of them was, Mikey was catching, you know, on the glove and shit. But AB got the first round. Man, then after that, it's like, man, AB was, AB was going into that high guard, man. AB was going into that high guard and Mikey was letting his hands go. You feel me? A few times, a few times through the course of the fight, shit, AB, you know, he had tried to walk Mikey down, land some eye-catchy shots, but for the most part, man, Mikey, you know, Mikey will feign him, Adrian will hop back a little bit, and his back will be on the ropes, and then he'll go into that high guard, you know, then Mikey will just well away. You know, that one-two, that hook around the gloves, and beating the body up. You feel me? A lot of shit didn't, a lot of shit, you know, a lot of shit caught the gloves. You feel me? But a lot of shit got through, too, and a lot of shit went, round, went around the gloves and shit. And I'm a nigga, I'm a nigga from Ohio. You feel me? I ain't being biased or nothing, man. I wanted to see a good fight. I would have loved to see AB win this big fight. You feel me? But shit, man, at the end of the day, I wanted to see a good fight. It went 12 rounds. Can't complain, man. Shit. I had AB at the, at the max, man. Maybe maybe winning three rounds. Maybe winning three rounds, man. You feel me? Garcia, he made that. And Garcia, people thought Adrian Speed was going to blow Garcia out the water, but, man, Garcia had, he had good ass, good speed too. He had good speed too, man. It wasn't really AB yet, but he had good speed of his own and reflexes. And I'm going to tell you how you can negate speed. You feel me? Shit. Like everybody say, it's that timing. And for the most part, shit, Mikey was, Mikey was leading. He was getting off first, man. You feel me? He was getting off first, and he was shooting combinations. That one, two down the middle around the glove and ripping ripping that body, man. Shit. That's just what it is. Can't you know? That's what it was. That's that's what the eye seen, man. Shit, that's what the eye seen. A.B., he found, you know, in like them late rounds, he found a little bit. He found a little bit of mustard where he was kind of, Going hard, trying to let it all hang out, but shit, for the most part, shit, man, Mikey was, he was boxing, backing up and everything, Mikey, yes, Mikey was boxing, backing up, a Mexican fighter, imagine that, boxing, backing up, man, you feel me, turning AB, you know, putting that pole out there, controlling AB's head and shit, man, Shit, a nine three is a stretch for real. Nine three is a stretch. You feel me? That's a stretch, man. And all oh, shit, AB wasn't motherfucking crying about it. He took his L like a man. You know, it wasn't no robbery. But I heard, I heard Robert Easter talking about it was a robbery, man. Shit, man, bro, we gotta, if we can't keep it real with the homies, man. You feel me? If we can't keep it real with the homies, how we expect them to improve? You feel me? By us lying to the homies or whatever or being biased, man, shit, that's setting them up for failure. You feel me? Shit, you got to keep it real with your mans. Shit. I mean, maybe he just wanted to, I don't know. Maybe Robert just ain't want to tell the truth out loud on TV. Maybe behind the scenes, he was like, yeah, A.B., you you know, you lost that one or whatever. Shit. 
But if, if you if you can't tell the truth to your homeboy, shit, don't say shit, man. Cause that's that's only handicapping him, handicapping him at the end of the day and shit, man. You gotta keep it real with the ones you love. Sometimes that's hard. Sometimes that's hard, man. For real, that tough love is hard. It's hard to keep it real, man. For real. But shit, at the end of the day, we only handicapping them. Yeah, it might. It might feel somewhat good at the time, you know, to cushion their ego or whatever, but down the road, that ain't helping A.B. to improve. We got to keep it real with the ones we love, man. Shit. Man, I had shit, man. I had Mikey 9-3, man. Mikey looked it good. No special effects. That he, he just all the way zipped up in fundamentals. All the way zipped up in fundamentals, man. Shit, that shit was crazy, man. AB was the, he, I mean, where the AB go from here? He was in shape. He said he was in shape. He said he was ready. He said he was the best shape of his life. Where he go from here, man? There's still some fights out there, man. Is he going to be a high-profile gatekeeper? What's going on? You feel me? What's going on? He got to let his hands go, but shit. Letting your hands go come with a consequence. You leaving yourself open for that big shot. But it's boxing. That's a chance you got to take. You feel me? That's a chance you got to take, man. Shit. I, I, you know what? I wonder what was AB's output before the Madonna fight and after the Madonna fight. I wonder is it a significant drop off and motherfucking punches attempted, punches thrown and shit, man. I'm curious about that. But but one thing for sure, if, if you ain't going to let your hands go, you just can't just stand there high guard. You don't let your hands go, you got to move. You feel me? Take away the hands, you got to add the legs. If you take away the hands, you got to add the legs, mean you got to move. So they ain't getting off, they ain't hitting you. You feel me? I mean, that's just what it is, man. That's just what it is. Leonard Ellerby, he guaranteed a victory. He said Mikey wasn't even in his, in Broner's class, period. You feel me? He put his foot in his mouth. You feel me? Niggas had to fess up after that. I knew Mikey could fight. I knew he could fight. You feel me? Despite motherfucking maybe only fighting Mexicans and shit. I knew Mikey could fight. Shit. Real shit. Knew Mikey could fight, man. That's crazy. And, and, and Mikey, he, he he stepped on the gas just a little bit, speeded up his pace just a little bit, where AB couldn't lay back. You feel me? Which, you know, that, that was the exact thing he needed to do. Just a little bit of pressure to speed AB up a little bit to make AB uncomfortable. You feel me? The faint jumping, jump back into the ropes, and then after that, it was just Mikey would faint. AB would jump back a little bit, and his back was on the ropes. You feel me? Then after that, it was just, it was just motherfucking Mikey. You know, cutting the rain off for them few little steps to get to him to get 